na big thanks for tuning into my channel. Mimi to Madube and of course I'm a happy soul. Na sipo soul in the building. Karibuni ndani ya Mad Castle of course pembeni bethe nipo na mwanangu fulani hivi wa nguvu. Ati unamhitaji hivi. Wani tanga Travolta. Au sio? Nasema yeah. kikucha Travolta. Niko fresh tu lakini pale kwa mitandao uh-huh. lazima ongeze underscore 254. Okay. Mm. So inakuwa Travolta underscore 254. Yeah. Alafu uh-huh. ukiwa celeb uh-huh. mashako ndio business yetu au sio mm. na si tupo hapa bethe ndo kama tuna mind our own business tuna mind our own business yeah. ila kuna issue fulani ambayo ndo kama imenigusa sana bro mm. na nimeona sio mbaya tukizungumzia kwa uh, nakumbuka wakati mimi nipo chuo mm-hmm. uh, ni one of the guys ambao ndo kama kwenye mziki wa gospel mm-hmm. nilikuwa na mfatilizia sana mm-hmm. na so yeye peke yake mm-hmm. akiwa na watu kadhaa consider ni kwamba history yake nilikuwa naifahamu mm-hmm. na hii bethe ndo kama amepata jina vizuri sana ila na feel kwamba kuna kuna vile na feel kwamba anatumia jina lake vibaya <laughs> na ile picha ambayo ndo kama alikuwa ametupaintia uh-huh. wakati anaanza game na sasa hii uh-huh. kuna utofauti mkubwa na na feel kwamba haikai sawa i don't know if it's just me uh-huh. ama pia kuna watu wengine watakuwa naichukulia hivyo na msanii ambaye tunamzungumzia uh-huh. ama tukipenda to discuss issue yake ni the big man himself uh-huh. uh, anaitwa Bahati uh-huh. Kenya umesema ni jina lake analitumia vibaya eh na na feel kwamba image na portray sasa hii mm-hmm. haitumii vizuri yes, na kama yes, jina ni lake jina ni jina ni lake yes <laughs> but um, yeah. i think to some way ndo kama anakuwa more extreme acha nikwambie nini na happen mm-hmm. Uh, katika pilika pilika zangu bethe nikipita kwenye mtandao mm-hmm. nikakutana na picha moja fulani hivi ndo kama yupo studio session mm-hmm. Excuse me na katika ile studio session na uh, nilikuwa nimekwenda ku record mm-hmm. i think ngoma yake mm-hmm. but uh, nikamcheki ndo kama amepiga siga fulani hivi na sijui kama ni siga kikweli ama ni weed ile cause tukiangalia kikweli na kama blunt fulani hivi najielewa unajua madhe wanga madhe wanga amishiku ni anaji na ilipata hiyo story alishikwa. Basi unajua kama tungekuwa na wajakoko for president, wajakoko ngekuwa president na tukikuwa tunasumbuka hivi sijui ni. Uko shiwa mzee. Uko shiwa. Sababu ilikuwa legal. No, unajua kuna kitu moja ambacho watu wa kielewi. Mm-hmm. Unajua kuwa kwenye power like mm-hmm. acha tu tuangalie if at all uh, Raila mm-hmm. angekuwa president. Mm-hmm. I feel kwamba angepata almost the same pinch mm-hmm. ambayo William Samoei anaipata mm-hmm. katika kile kiti ambacho ndo kama yupo. Acha nkuulize wewe. Mhm. Tuseme mnakatia dem flani. Tuseme mimi na wewe tunakatia dem. Unakuja kwa dem sasa. Sitokupatie tu mfano uh-huh. kipusa. Yeah. Yeah, kama ile Steve Simbu. Mhm. Na tunakatia kipusa. Mhm. Unaishi kwamba zile challenges utapitia ndio mimi tutapitia. Kuna Uh, sio 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 the date the same yeah, yeah, yeah. yes sio same mm-hmm. lakini kuna vitu ambavyo mtagongana ambavyo vitakuwa ni the same yeah, <coughs> nataka we understand mm-hmm. we have we all have different abilities mm-hmm. na we have different strength na mm-hmm. different weaknesses mm-hmm. mimi naishi kwamba hata kama ungekuwa mtu mwingine pale sasa hivi mm-hmm. ungekuwa na different challenges but sasa ungekuwa na approach a different approach Nisa. Yeah. ni sawa lakini unajua pia katika okay sijai soma constitution yote mm-hmm. but pia na feel kwamba kuna laws ambazo ndo kama zina govern mm-hmm. wala watu ambao ndo kama wanaingia kwa power mm-hmm. unanipata mm-hmm. so kwa tulete kwa upande wa watoto wa kike mm-hmm. unajua mtoto wa kike yule bro si ati kuna vitu vimemfunga funga kisheria ati anafaa Unajua pia na mtihani wake Buda kwani una dating yake na nanya wana principles. Ah ah sima bwana principles. <laughs> Wewe ulieleta ukaisema kwamba ubaisema kwamba <laughs> abilities zako na abilities zangu <laughs> uh, tukiweza kuziweka kwa mwanamke mmoja <laughs> una feel kwamba hatutakuwa na similarities ambazo tunaweza face. Yaani nitasema yaani tukiatiu dem ama tukimnini itakuwa na different itakuwa na itakuwa na difference. Kuna challenges unajua difference itakuja wapi mm-hmm. uh, yule dem kwanza akatoa na tuseme kama ni sisi wawili mm-hmm. ukileta dem umweke hapa katikati alafu wambie i choose kati ya madubi na travolta mm-hmm. hakuna uwezekano akatoka na madubi kwa 
Basi yeye ndiye anakuwa na test. Okay, mimi nimejiamini. <laughs> nimejiamini wa design. So, uh-huh. all I'm saying is uh-huh. ule demo akija, atamcheki madubi, atamcheki uh-huh. Travolta. So, kati yao watu wawili ambao ataangalia, uh-huh. kuna mmoja ata develop interest. Uh-huh. Wanapata kuna uwezekano mm-hmm. kwamba aki develop interest kwa mmoja wenu mm-hmm. so inamaanisha kwa madubi itakuwa rais alafu goja kwanza alafu kwa Travolta kidogo uh-huh. itakuwa itakuwa na hit love hit love kidogo ama either way kwa bro. ngoja tulia kwanza bro acha ni support sasa no 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 angalika sana acha uh, ni support acha ni support mimi nataka tufanye kitu experiment ah uh, acha ni kwanza experiment kwanza so la sema <laughs> Ah, uh, usiona so na approach yangu kwake mm-hmm. uh, itakuwa different. Sitakuwa na ugumu mwingi. Unapata. Mm. <laughs> Lakini wewe kidogo utasota sota hapa katikati. Ah. Iweke kivyo. Lakini uh-huh. huyu demo akuwe eh, hana interest kwangu mm-hmm. na hana interest kwako. Mm-hmm. Si wote tutasota bro. Mm. Unapata? Tutapitia changamoto hizi. Unasema kusota, kwani unatumia anga hela kwa tiana. Ah, si, sio kusota zini, sio kusota kukosa hela. Mm-hmm. Yaani utahangaika utatoa mm. jasho kweli. Afresh basi wacha tuingilie swala letu la bahati uh-huh. tuache mambo ya siasa na madem. Tulifikaje kwanza hapa? <laughs> 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 Anakumbuka tuliingiaje? Uh-huh. Tuliingia kwa ile point ya wajakoa yangekuwa yeah, nini? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but anyway, na sema sorry ilikuwa nakwambia mm. I think pia huko juu mm. kuna laws ambazo ndo kama zinawa govern. Mm. So kit pia kingekuwa kikomoto kwa upande wa mm. upande wa mzee. But anyway, so nilikuwa nasema issue yangu tu mm. bahani kwamba Uh, ile picha ambayo ndo kama aliweza kuipost kwenye mtandao wa Instagram sawa at least aliweza kuoneshana mafanzo wake kwamba eh, nime smoke pia mimi mm-hmm. nimeweza nika smoke mm-hmm. na akaweza kuitoa nje na mashabiki wakaiona unajua sasa hii bro tule tunaangalia ni kwamba eh, ni mtu tumemfuatilizia na pengine kuna mtu ndo kama ana wish unajua kuna mtu by the way sahii ana wish angepata ile position ambayo bahati yuko nayo angekuwa zile steps angekuwa amepiga mhm ah yeye ni steps zingine hatari sana utif tu yangalie hii design mhm ule msee ameenda kwa nini ameenda pale studio mhm ame anaandika ngoma hii lady alafu ndaka sabahani sorry for that <coughs> alafu unataka ngoma moto <coughs> suna smoke no ngoma to wake no, no. unajua ukiweka kivo unataka kuiweka kwamba mhm Bahando watu ngoma mm-hmm. lazima akuwe under influence. Jesema lazima. Don't put words in my mouth. No, kulingana wewe oh, unasema wakati Nisema, ngoma haileti. Yeye alikuwa atakutoa ngoma moto. Mhm. Oh, ojo ile plant. <laughs> I think ni kuelewa gota basi siende bure. But anyway, ah uh-huh. uh, ki sawa mm-hmm. itakuwa iko hivyo. Mm-hmm. Anajua kumekuwa na history kwamba ameiondokea gospel. Mm-hmm. But I don't think by the way, yeah. atakwaje ameiondokea gospel wakati after hiyo hiyo incident mm-hmm. ametoa gospel ya yeah, ile ngoma ile letter strike yake eh. ya utarudi lini eh okay ili gospel ile isianuliza Yesu atarudi lini anataka Yesu arudi sasa ndo nashangaa anataka arudi apata hizo mabadi eh ukijana na kurejea mambo eh kwa nini flani hivi ya nini E, Rosari mm-hmm. ametaja bana kwamba Roscoe ndo amefanya jamaa akaja gospel. Eh yeah, yeah, na pose. Yeah, na pose. Eh, unaizi kwamba ni kweli. Uh, I think ni ni mistari alijaribu tu kuwa creative, alijaribu pia ku pass message kwamba ah jamaa wenu wameanguka mm-hmm. sababu alifuata Roscoe of which uh, kwa upande wake ana feel ni hivyo mm-hmm. but kwa upande wetu sisi mm-hmm clearly mean understand ndo hawa watu ndo waache game by the walikuwa criticized vibaya sana mm-hmm. na ili waumiza cause pia wao wenyewe mm-hmm. ndani ya industry ama ndani ya ministry ya gospel mm-hmm. walikuwa wanadunga na dungana instead ya kwa kushauriza na wanasupportiana yani kuuliza kati ya mm-hmm. ile kazi wao nafanya mm-hmm. hakuna challenges hakuna challenges ni sasa unaacha tunasema kwamba acha mimi nikakufa njaa mm-hmm eh timana kuna challenge no sometimes it's it's too it's too much to bear 
Acha nikwambie mm. mimi nahisi kwamba si matusi si si hizo hizo vitu so si si kwamba ndio hizo zilifanya mimi mm-hmm. naona kama inaweza kuata ni horoscope inaweza mm-hmm. kuwa ni made maybe inaweza kuwa tu ni different ama maybe walifuta hela uwezi jua i think pia uh, twende hiyo side kwanza mm-hmm. i think pia industry ya secular mm-hmm. ilikuwa na i think ilikuwa na opportunities mob mm-hmm kulikuwa na more fun in terms of uh, in terms of maulevi mm. in terms of sherehe mm. in terms of kupiga eh yani unapata kuna freedom na uko na freedom mm. sherehe kuitwa events za club mm. kuitwa hizi ma events kuna kwa nakumbuka wakati wakati mimi ndo naanza mambo ya entertainment sio kwa mm. mimi kwa photographer wa kupiga hizi ma events kama Roman Vago na Cam Kenya watu kama mm. kina Chronics nilikuwa naenda kupiga ma photography huko mm. so napata walikuwa na feel wanataka kuwa katika such shows because mm. ukiangalia kitambo mm. E, shows za uh, gospel mm. zilikuwa rare sana but unajua kuna time kuna kipindi gospel ilikuwa juu kuliko kuliko secular. Na no, karibu na mic basi. Eh <laughs> <laughs> kuna time gospel ilikuwa juu kuliko secular. Uh, wakati kulikuwa na hiyo kipindi cha magroove hizo times za magroove. Hata before groove. Mm. Eh hey, umeve kuna time Ringtone alikuwa bwana yeye ndo kusema alibebwa. Oh happy. Alibebwa. Kuna kijana alikuwa moto time ah. zake bwana. Oh wakati wa Pamela yes. Wakati wa Pamela before Pamela yes. But hawa mbele mbele Ringtone. Mm-hmm. Hata wakati wa LJ Masai kuja kutoka toka wakati LJ Masai kuja kachukua yeah. Melatist of the Year. My, my friend Groove iliharibu mziki. Uh, iliharibu gospel. I think hiyo ndio ilichangia pia wasanii kuja kutoka toka. Though sina story mm. ya Groove vizuri. I wish ningekuwa na niko na hizo details. Acha niwaambie. Niambie. Kama ulikuwa unasoma hiyo program, mm. ulikuwa Groove kikaribia ili sizo na Groove kikaribia mm. wasanii ndio walikuwa natongoa. Ah, no. hey, vote for me, vote for me. Eh, hey, washinde hizo mawaji sijui aseme ati wewe ndo mnome ni nini. Eh, uh-huh. hey, kilikuwa ki, 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 yani walikuwa na vitu huko. Mimi naweza kuomba ilikuwa imechangia kwamba mm-hmm. mziki watu wako wako nafanya mziki for God. Oh. Wako nafanya mziki for awards. For awards. Eh, yeah, na for acknowledgement of people. Unajua God anaweza sema utongoma. Mm. Na kumbe ngoma ni msemo mmoja peke yake. Eh, no, no. eh lakini walikuwa wanatoa, walikuwa wanatoa ngoma bro. Zilikuwa zinatoka na zilikuwa ngoma poa. Lakini sasa unaona squeeze wako wapi? Wametoka eh, huko karibu wote. Yeah, sababu no I think kulikuwa ufiti na fulani uliingilia katika gospel ministry na ikachangia wase wakaanza kusambaratika siku zata wale magwiji ambao ndo kama tulikuwa tunaaminia eh, wengine walibebwa bebo waliolewa wakatoka toka nje ya country kafanya pia gospel pia kashuka yani i think uh, ilikuwa point fulani ya gospel maybe ku shuka uh, god alikuwa anachagua bwana god alikuja na kichungi anachagua watu wake mm-hmm. uh, acha wengine acha wengine ndio acha 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 nikwambie kuna time gospel ndio ilikosekana ikarudi mm-hmm. chini siku ile ikarudi juu mm-hmm. na hapo ndo hapo ndo watu walitoka nini gospel wakasema acha acha mimi ndio nifanye kazi sekula mm-hmm. eh okay eh, lakini mimi mimi nimeokoka lakini acha ndio nifanye kazi sekula nikapige eh. nika test e at the world <coughs> nisikie mbele mm-hmm. kuna time bidhe pose alikuwa na scandal kulikuwa sewa sekula bidhe kwa gospel <laughs> <laughs> <And a scandal. laughs> it was very interesting at that time <laughs> acha nikwambie that time uh-huh. eh, pose uh-huh. alikuwa so much inspired with diamond uh, na sahi alikuwa inspired hata sahi uh-huh. alikuwa so much inspired uh-huh. na diamond ni video tu uh-huh. at least ameweza ku experience kitu ambacho diamond ame ki experience mm. unapata Eh uh-huh. unapata vizuri kwa hivyo namfuata namfuata kila mahali namfuata kila, kila sekta kila sekta ah. kila sekta ni vile sahihi uh-huh. washakuwa will uh-huh. pole pia amekuwa mkubwa so uh-huh. ako sawa ako sawa uh-huh. but anyway kwa issue yangu ya nani ya uko satisfied na hiyo se- sekta ingine turudi kwa baba big was that na hizi kwamba gospel siku hizi wameharibu watu watu na watu wa imbi gospel siku hizi but unafaa kurudi kwa mziki wa gospel bro ndarudi wewe rapa mnoma bro ndarudi ndarudi wewe rapa mnoma sana unafaa kurudi huko at least sasa shida ni ndugu yangu hata chani yes na kwambia bro 
Un ogro aullido que llega a la... But go back and do gospel music, bro. So when you gonna find your regular? No, no, no. It's a bit of a fungo channel. Watch out to pick a story. I love to fungo channel. Oh yeah. To kimaliza, to kimaliza this episode. Eh. Make sure on engia YouTube. Eh. Ona subscribe kwa channel ya tutaitaje. Tutafutia tu jina. No, no, no. Ipati a jina sa easy. Kiaje. Atwezi kuwa tunapiga show nzuri hivi, alafu uh-huh. pia unakosa channel na uko na vitu ambavyo unaweza ukavipiga mle ndani. Travolta bus. Travolta. Yeah. Uh, guys, let me tell you something. Nimekaa hapa na rapa fulani mnoma sana. Yaani huyu jamaa ni mnoma, mnafaa kumsikiza. Tunafungua channel, mm-hmm. tuna make sure unaangusha vitu vyako kwa dadi. Labda tutuanze na freestyle. Aina noma uh-huh. lakini at least unajua sio akipata hiyo touch mm-hmm. you never know hata bahati mwenyewe anaweza kuwa interested aseme sina rapper kwenye label so acha to try kutafuta stack stack unataka kusaini na kubati eh ah bwana huyu muone kile wisdom alifanywa no ni kina Mr C lakini na nielewa bro <coughs> hakuna mambo ya kutojielewa kutojielewa i think ungekuwa unajielewa vizuri wangekuwa wako poa so unataka kusema Kenya kati yao sio walikuwa nafanywa hivyo hakuna wako wanajielewa ndio nasema ni kutojielewa sababu eh, we kama kipindi unajua unasainiwa mm-hmm. lazima unajua uko na exit plan kwamba itafika point hapa sitaka sana my friend wale watu wanakufungia pale na contract zingine hata wewe hizo unaletoa contract ya page 5 sulienda shule kizungungu no, 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 no. sulienda shule Una, unajua sasa nikwambie mm. <coughs> kuna msee anaweza kuja kuambie eh, budo kuna sema kupata kwa street unapata mm-hmm. akwambie mm-hmm. kuja nikuokolee okay kati ile kokolea akwambia mm-hmm. hebu kujo sign hizi vitu mm-hmm. uone sign tu hizi vitu ujui huyu msee amekusainia for fault unipata ni wewe ulipatikana in a desperate mode unipata na na kuelewa by the way kwa hiyo angle mm. na kuelewa let's say take kama case ya Peter Blessing mm-hmm. uh, i think kama atakuwa alipatiwa contracts wakati ndo ana join MB mm-hmm. uh, lazima kuna vitu vitakuwa vimempita Peter lakini mimi think ni mm-hmm. level of understanding Okay kuna eh yeah. kuna pata msia na so much info about Tuseme tu ni ignorance in short ignorance ignorance is the biggest nini ya uh... na pia kukuwa over excited eh yeah. unje pia msia wewe kitu wa kitu tu una say eh yeah. apart from hiyo yeah. angalia msia anafaidika nini unajua unajua you every every relationship mm. or friendship or every nini yuko gana nini kuna kugana benefit Mm-hmm. both sides. Mm-hmm. So ukiangalia huyu mse ama angalia anga tu. Hata mse kikupea dobu ule. Kuna kitu anafaidika. Lazima. Eh, yeah. sawa. Tuipozie hapo kwanza. Mm-hmm. Uh, let's go back to issue yetu ya baha uh, kuweza ku ku post kwa mtandao mm-hmm. akiwa yupo na blunt. Mm-hmm. Naipata. Mm-hmm. Uh, for me haijakuwa I think angefanya vyote kiaje vyote uh, angefanya angefanya vyote kama ni mambo na kupigwa ma lap dance sina issue nayo my friend my friend excuse me oh, bro excuse me nasuguliwa kwenye mevlab ndio nakwambia <laughs> okay so for hiyo nayo uh, nita nita ni, ni understand sababu ni kama line of duty hiyo ni kazi eh hiyo ni kazi lakini kazi nyingine ni tamu <laughs> <laughs> Bila naweza yeka hivyo. Ni ni kweli. Ah mm-hmm. uh, kwa, kwa line of duty mm-hmm. na kama ni home eh, vitu ambavyo anavifanya na wife yake mm-hmm. ame ni watu tusema moana mm-hmm. so inakubalika si ni partner wake. Mm-hmm. But uh, kwa mtu ambaye we ni public figure watu wanakuangalia mm-hmm. watu wana wanakuadmire oh si kuadmire mm-hmm. wana, wana wanapata inspiration kutoka kwako. Mm-hmm na unajua kitu kama uh, weed bro mm-hmm. kuna watu ambao ndo kama inawakia vizuri sana mm-hmm. lakini pia tuko na serious cases za kwamba kuna watu wanapotoka wanapata kuna watu mm-hmm. ambao kama maisha yao yanaenda stray kupitia vitu na vitu kama hivyo mm-hmm. i think uh, so kitu ambacho ndo kama angekieka kwa public kihivyo considering pia sawa ni brand kubwa na na deal na ma corporates pia mm-hmm. for such a case mm-hmm. na tukiangalia kitu kama weed haiko legalized mm-hmm. bro na wanaweza ku portray kwa mtandao do you feel kwamba it's a good picture me i think me niuma by the way si kufurahia yani. ni, ni kitu mbaya lakini najua mimi kusoma tu kwa ile watu sifuatilie ngi sana mm. manake <coughs> Pina si transition au msi kutoka kwa mtoto wa mama mm-hmm. akakuwa mtoto wa Diana nilikuwa najua tu utakuja kwa mtoto wa Diana sasa sasa hivi mtoto wa ndio nataka naambie 
Kitu wa mashada Kitu wa mashada For me Sijui uh, si, Sijasikia poa mm-hmm. Sijasikia poa Mokutana na hiyo foto mze Nimecheki bwana mm-hmm. Hamekiwasha Hamekiwasha same flani hapo Bethesi poa Iki tutudi vile tutu kwa tunaisema mm-hmm. Umse pia ni buda ni buda ndio alafu umse ni watu wengi sana wanamfollow mm-hmm. unajua hiyo ni kitu most celebs they don't know mm-hmm. kuna wasi akona following kubwa sana ya watu hii yes kuna wasi wana aspire ama wana onona i want to be like this guy you know but mm-hmm. so alafu na washaki blunt pale mhm wa muko with khalifa akwa with khalifa mhm with khalifa yes ni kuchoma <coughs> alichoma matari ngoje kwa hivyo watu wache kuimitate wazungu mhm tuko tu ki Afrika nasema blunt ni wazungu peke yake ah eh ndio kuna watu wafiji huko majuu but in notion ya kuna kitu moja pia sija understand in notion ya kitu si tukifanya kitu Uh, tunakuwa compared na watu wa, wa majuu kwamba tuna copy from them mm. siji ina, inatokea wapi una, una copy ama mkopi uh, in some way tuna copy si si in some way muna kuna copy. vitu hatu copy bro. kama gani kuna vitu hatu copy nipe nipe kitu mkopi mm, hatu copy sisi tushapoteza originality yetu kama wa Afrika <laughs> Sisi tunafuata wazungu kama kondoo tu. Tusepo kweli. Kweli kina nani? Volta wela kina nani? Buda kwa nini Masai? Ah 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 tra wela kina nani? Ni ruka sana. Hapo I think uko peke yako. Sawa, I think wametufungua njia in some way. Na tukisema tuna copy ni vitu ambavyo Eh yenyewe inafaa tuchunge tuchunge kitu mm-hmm. tuangalie ni nini cha kukopi mm-hmm. na nini cha kukataa si hatu kile tu kila kitu una dish una unachukua una nini yeah. unasema wewe okay, kile anything unasema una buda wizi ndio mkimo ule tu gideri ule tu chapo ule tu ndondo sijui nini eh mazee tumbo itakuharibikia wewe hujatembea events wewe kiaje nafu tembea event alafu nakutana na vitu kama hivyo wedding marura show bofe eh anisha yenda bwana unapewa sahani Uh-huh. Unaanzia huko <laughs> chakula mbaya mbaya. Tembo figo huko chakula mbaya. Eh zile tutamtam. Au sio? Ah let's do this mm-hmm. for hiyo action ambayo Bahama ichukua. Unajua paka ile post paka size ni mwana haijatoka. Ipo bado na mm-hmm. haimuumizi haimsumbui kichwa. Sasa yes, unajua yeye alikuwa anasema ati mseme kile sijui kile mnapenda ama kunachukia. Mm-hmm. Na sisi tumesema kitu tunachukia atupendi ukivuta bangi atupendi eh ama Ana, masiga vitu kama hizo yeah, at, 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 at fadhali basi angeitumia kwa music video kama ku act mm. eh yeah, yeah. kama ni ngoma wanatoa kwa pale kwa studio yeah. haizi kwa ngoma sijua bwana haizi kwa ngoma bro mm-hmm. ile ilikuwa strategy mm-hmm. unajua kina nani wa understand industry pia vile ambavyo ina work kina baha mm-hmm. lazima uongelelee ndio lazima uongelelee ndio utengoma so Lakin, imagine E, unapigia blunt mm. alafu e, unakuja unatoa ngoma ya gospel my friend vile wazee wanaendelea mtu anatembea ndeje alafu anakuja kutoa ngoma ya gospel na hapo kuna hapo na limits hapo hawezi wakafika bro wewe ni mara ngapi wao wasema ba address address ah wewe unaweza ba address siwezi ba address lazaje ku ba address mzee ah but hii my history na hiyo ki ba address itakutoa ah mimi siwezi Siwezi bule. Kwani umechoma ni? <laughs> But anyway, so so kitamba cha I feel kwamba mimi naweza nikakifanya hicho. But kuna watu wanafanya kwa sababu wanafeel kwamba ni creatives. Yes, creative. Sio creative. Eh? Na wamekwa mabwana. Tu wamekwa. Yeah. It's, it's not a good thing. It's not a good thing. Kwa sababu mimi story ya wasiku ba dress ina nyuma sana. Ila kuuma, unasikia ungekuwa na kiboko ungekuwa. Buda mimi sijeo na buda ngo ba dress. Hmm. Na siwezi imagine kitu kaa hiyo. Ndio yeah. ona babu yango mbadala. <coughs> Naweza kuwa hajawahi kuonesha lakini naweza kuwa alimewahi kuvaa lakini hajawahi kuonesha. Sasa si ndio hiyo hawezi onesha in public. Hao yeah. sasa onesha in public. I think wanafaa eh yeah, wanafaa kuizuia zile hapa. Yeah, wanafaa hii vitu ah waje ni ku post mna mm. bomu. Mm. Mm. Eh but ya maisha hawa jamaa mm. ni ngumu sana. I don't think uh, uh, anafaa kufanya kitu kama hicho acha naonge naye. So basi juu mimi feel kwamba kwa watu ambao unawa inspire bro. 
e, it's, it's not a good picture ku paint kwa mtandao na such type of a pic kwamba upo na blunt alafu ndo kama kuna watu na kufuatilizia like kama mimi mimi napenda sana bahati ambavyo progress yake imekuwa up to now unapata mm-hmm. kibiashara kimziki na unajua sasa hivi bethe pia nilifika point nikaanza kuwa shabiki wa bahati compared to kuna time flani nilikuwa na mshabikia kabisa lakini kafika mahali mm-hmm. ah nilihafu kwa fan wake sasa wewe si tu mentor vice versa bila kwa fan wake akiwa gospel okay uh, vile lingeo kwingine yeah. ah ndiacha kuliacha kwa fan yeah, of which it's not, it's not a bad thing the the thing ni kwamba bado kuna watu ambao wana inspire mm-hmm. but pia kichuzi source yake inspiration i think anafa pia kuwa considerate mm. au sio kabisa anyway ndivyo ulivyo choose mzee mm-hmm. so sawa lakini pia nipo ukiangalia maana yake unajua pia wanakuwa alafu kuna watoto pia wapo nyuma itafika e, point tutakuwa na wacha na watoto ambao watakuja kuhanga na watu wengine mm-hmm naona na pia unajua una sometimes mna unataki wangu kwa vita ambavyo sio vyako mm. let's say for example eh, mzee afanye kitu kibaya mm. alafu mimi nimeenda shule watoto wa, wa, you, you get umenisoma mwanangu eh hizo vitu hizo vitu eh hey, budako anavutanga ndo eh zinakuja zina affect yeah, alafu unajua uh, internet never forgets kabisa mm. kabisa so maybe akicheck hivyo na kukua consider for such things <coughs> Uh, itakuwa ni poa anyway kwa wafanyi wetu ambao ndio kama natufuatilizia tupia comment yako na ambao una feel vipi kuhusiana na issue nzima ya ile action ambayo bahali uza kuchukua na kumea kushoko ambayo ndio kama na pause na blunt kwenye insta i mean so kwenye insta kwenye i mean kwenye instagram account yake na unaichukuliaje is it a good thing or is it a bad thing